After spending many years to get my degree in agriculture, I finally have done it. Now I've moved back to my family farm to revive it. I only have $500 to my name and all the equipment I shall need to make millions. Let's revive my family's farm one day at a time. Welcome to Cattle RP. Well, good morning, Buster. How you doing, buddy? Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to American Farming. We have a lot of things we have to do today. We already have our cattle. We have $500 to our name. And we do have an extra two field or two. So we do own this other field over here. Of course, everybody knows that field eight and field nine both come with the starting farm. And of course, we upgraded and also got ourselves field 10. Along with that, we also went ahead and got ourselves as a starting harvester everything else is as base game as you can now it's just time to get on up in the year the first thing we really need to do i just got those cows the other day the first thing we honestly need to do is get this over here into the field and start chopping some silage so now we can go ahead and get this harvested because this is what we need to feed the cows with it's actually not going too bad we need to make sure to keep this on straight we should get about two or three trailers full which should last us enough time i am have one of the neighbor kids planting this morning already he's planting and fit corn in one of the other in the other field we are going to get him to instantly come over here and start planting this field as well just so we can have more going on than just one field at a time do want to line all these fields up where we're harvest 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 so we're not going to go past it until we get all three fields harvested now of course we are electing to only fertilize with cow manure because it's just a cheaper alternative than using all the others and of course it just puts down both since we're choosing to put down just that we are just gonna use that instead of wasting our time on the other stuff so i went ahead and replaced my neighbor he went and took the forage harvester so i'm gonna take over planting for a little bit for him so that we can at least get a little bit of planting in today um went ahead and checked back there everything was doing good except row number five so what i did is i went ahead and picked it up a little bit just to make sure that everything will run a little bit smoother i do definitely hope that she at least holds out for the rest of this and once we get done with planting I want to take one more good look over this entire tractor because I do feel and the other worker did as well that the tractor was slipping a little bit in gears like right now I don't feel like she's giving me a hundred percent of what she's got and there we go so this one is planted in corn now what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna head down the road and we are gonna plant the other field that we have in corn I think he said that he is about a quarter of the way full I'll check on him in a little bit once I get down here and get going I'll call him up make sure oh yeah he's getting some work put in yeah he's done at least two more passes than what i left him at so i put him over there again and i went in and jumped into here and we are about halfway done right now we just got to keep it on going smoothly he is getting that done over there which shouldn't take us no time at all to at least get this one full and let him continue planting that entire field because as you can see here we have every we have at least this one over here planted and we have to plant this big bigger one over here and then we've got to replant this this field i'm in and currently all right so we just filled this up now so what we gotta do we gotta run it over here to the harvester which is this blue bin and we gotta unload it all into here so i don't know how much of this i want to at least put into here i know i want to put at least a good amount of it but i'm not 100 sure what all we're gonna put in there do know i want to possibly get some corn off of this and just feed them bells and this so what i may do is i may just get one more good load off of this and then throw the rest into just normal corn and go sell it because you got to be making some kind of money.
and there is the end of the field. Wow, that took a lot longer to set your nighttime. I still have to go collect the other tractor that has the planter on it. So let's go do that real fast so that we can call it a night here pretty soon. Well, before we actually go to bed, I do want to at least feed these cows at least one thing full of corn. All right, it looks like he just left it out here in the field for me. That means we are good to rock and roll. And that will mean we can just go back on home. I'm going to plant this field in the middle in between the videos. So that means we'll have everything ready to go because we're doing a mega harvest in the next video hopefully and we'll be able to do a little bit more of a deeper dive into cattle also in the next video as well now let's go ahead and fill this up with some corn which there's plenty plenty of corn in here now so we should be good i'm just just going to drive all the way around i don't have to deal with backing this up because this is not easy to back up with we'll drive all the way around here i guess i gotta put up all that fun stuff as well and this will just be here to make sure the cows at least have some food in their troughs before we go to bed tonight and get working on the other stuff in the morning see the cows are ready to rock and roll and now it's just time for them to have babies and after a little bit we'll end up having ourselves some baby calves but ladies and gentlemen that will be in today's video that is all i have for today if y'all appreciate the videos that we have been pushing out for you guys please leave a like subscribe do what you guys do best we'll see you next time peace